welcome to MWC 2022. Now many of the tech vendors and service providers here at MWC are seeking to increase collaborations in order to deliver new and highly valuable services to enterprise customers. One example is VMware and BT's successful partnership. It spans several areas including the supply of infrastructure to support BT's mobile services and internal IT needs. However, we are here today to discuss the recently announced news that both companies are going to work together to deliver SASE services. So I am delighted to be joined today by Bas Berger, his Chief Executive Officer, Global at BT Group, and Sanjay Apal, Senior Vice President and General Manager, Service Provider and Edge Business Unit at VMware. Gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us. Now, I'd like to start with you, Bas. First of all, could you maybe summarize the market that uh, your global unit supports and how partnerships such as the one with VMware supports your development and how you see those relationships and collaborations evolving in the years ahead? Well, the market that we support uh, is, uh, is, a, is a global market, hence the name. So we only focus on multinational corporations and some large governments and what we provide to them is an outcome, and the outcome is is that the infrastructure they use, the connectivity and the telecommunication infrastructure they use globally, you know, is stable and has a predictable performance. Now, in a world where um, companies, multinational corporations, more and more use multi-clouds and are more dependent on applications in this multi-cloud environment to actually work for their supply chains and for their people at home to be productive. Um, it is more and more important that this infrastructure works extremely well. And in order to do that, you need to depend on very strong partnerships. We cannot do that all by, the, by ourselves because we deliver the end-to-end the -end connectivity, we deliver the, the infrastructure and the foundation. But VMware, for example, delivers the software, the edge, and the SASE security, as you, as you mentioned uh, before. So partnerships for us in that context is really important to work fast and to be flexible. Now, Sanjay, I've got a similar question for you. What trends are you seeing in your, in your market, especially in terms of collaborations? And how do you expect to support companies like BT in their own development? Yeah, there's, a, there's actually a sea change that is going on right now with enterprises. And there's a quiet revolution that is as big as what people say as the metaverse or as crypto or as EVs. And that revolution is all about how networking and networking services, security services, and compute services are moving to the edge. And whenever one talks about the edge, where the edge is distributed across a number of locations, the network always comes in. And this is where the partnership between VMware and BT comes in, because what enterprises want is that resiliency. They want to make sure that they can depend on the infrastructure. And this is where the partnership, this is where BT comes in, and VMware, of course, to supply the software technology and the services to go along with BT so that we can serve the needs of the enterprise. Now, I would like to shift the focus away from technology for a moment and talk about sustainability. As we know, it's become really uh, important in terms of the corporate agenda. So tell us what your sustainability targets and ambitions are. So what VMware does really well is that we set up a software stack, digital infrastructure, that allows much more efficient use of the hardware. In fact, we started that off in the data center by supplying our virtualization technology. What we're doing now is taking that same virtualization technology and extending it out across the network, even up to and including the endpoints. Whenever you do that and you have more efficient use of the hardware, then that helps save the power, it helps save the planet, and it's really our focus towards sustainability. So we have sustainability as a fundamental goal, not just to get to things like 5G, but also beyond. We're working together with a number of other players on the next G, the 6G that's coming in, for which a specific focus is about sustainability. Bas, could you share BT's sustainability targets with us? And how can companies like VMware support you in this journey? Well, our ambition for sustainability is an important part for our BT manifesto, which is something that we have presented a few months ago, which basically consists of us being um, responsible, being inclusive, and being sustainable as a, co as a company. I mean, we've, we're, we've been working on sustainability for over 30 years, far before it became popular uh, in many different ways. Um, and in September, we have announced that we are going to pull forward our um, net zero promise by 15 years. So that means we're going to be net, complete net zero uh, in uh, 2030. 
And we also expect our partners and our supply chains that we are using to do the same thing. Now, obviously, uh, VMware is such an important partner. What Sanjay was just talking about is also extremely important for us to understand you know, how our partnership can become more sustainable as well. And it's simply also because our customers are demanding this from both of us. You know, if we provide network, if we provide multi-cloud environments, if we provide them to work with technology, it needs to be provided in a sustainable fashion. Um, so it's, it's just as important as the technology itself. Now, I have a final question to both of you. If you were to give a piece of advice to a CTO or a CIO to help grow their business through technology, what would it be? Well, if it's only one, only one I can only say one thing. Oh, that's difficult. Um, because assuming that this customer would work in an environment where he, wants, he or she wants to innovate and wants to move to the cloud and wants to use technology to, to compete in their individual industry, I, my piece of advice, advice would be make sure that when you do that, you look to build uh, that world on a very, very strong foundation. A foundation which works all the time, so you can use all this innovation that you want at any time you want, in any place you want, because you build it on a, on a really strong foundation of infrastructure which is secure, which can adapt, which, um, you know, which has a predictable performance, and which also can answer all the security and cyber threat questions in the future. Sanjay, what's your take on this? What advice would you give? Yeah, I just want to echo what Bass said, but I want to put it in terms that classic rock would understand. So, you know, there's a song from the Rolling Stones called Get Off My Cloud. So I would tell the CIO to not be afraid of moving out from the cloud towards the edge and adopt what Aerosmith had. They had a song called Living on the Edge. So you're living on the edge, you can trust BT and VMware to work together to make sure that your infrastructure is resilient and you're prepared for this next generation of applications. And then rock and roll. Well, thank you very much to both of you. Thank you, Charlotte. Thank you.